Welcome back to our channel, History Enthusiasts. In today's episode, we dive into the remarkable life and legacy of one of the most influential figures of the 20th century, Tito Joseph Braz, also known as Marshal Tito. Join us as we explore the captivating story of a visionary leader and World War II resistance fighter who left an indelible mark on Yugoslavia's history. Let's get started. Tito's journey began in modest circumstances. Born into a peasant family on May 7, 1892, in Kumrovic, Croatia, he experienced firsthand the struggles and inequalities prevalent in early 20th century Europe. This upbringing laid the foundation for his strong socialist beliefs and his determination to fight for the rights of the working class. Tito's political awakening took place during First World War, where he served as an Austro-Hungarian army officer. However, it was during World War II that Tito's true mettle was tested, and he emerged as a central figure in the resistance against Nazi occupation. Following the German invasion and occupation of Yugoslavia in 1941, Tito became the leader of the Yugoslav Partisans, the largest and most effective resistance movement in the country. Under his command, the Partisans waged a relentless guerrilla war against the Axis powers, engaging in sabotage, intelligence gathering, and military operations. Tito's strategic acumen, combined with his ability to unite diverse groups and forge alliances, played a crucial role in the success of the Partisans. His leadership skills and determination earned him respect both within Yugoslavia and among the international community. One of the most significant episodes of Tito's leadership during World War II was the Battle of Suceska in 1943. The German forces launched a major offensive against the Partisans, seeking to eliminate their presence in the rugged mountains of Bosnia and Herzegovina. However, Tito skillfully coordinated the defense, leading his forces in a daring breakout that resulted in the successful evacuation of the partisan leadership and a significant blow to the Axis powers. Tito's resistance movement also gained crucial support from the Allies, particularly the British. The Allies recognized the partisans as a legitimate fighting force and provided them with supplies, weapons, and training. This assistance significantly bolstered the partisans' capabilities and further solidified Tito's position as a key figure in the fight against fascism. After the end of World War II, Tito's leadership extended beyond the battlefield. He played a central role in the establishment of the Socialist Federal Republic of Yugoslavia, a diverse federation comprising various ethnic groups. Tito's vision for Yugoslavia was based on principles of self-management, socialism, and non-alignment. Under Tito's governance, Yugoslavia experienced a period of economic development, social reforms, and international recognition. His leadership fostered a sense of unity among the diverse ethnic groups, and his commitment to non-alignment allowed Yugoslavia to pursue an independent path during the Cold War, maintaining relationships with both the Eastern Bloc and the Western powers. Tito Josip Braz's role in World War II as a resistance fighter and leader of the Yugoslav partisans stands as a testament to his courage, strategic brilliance, and unwavering commitment to freedom. His ability to unite diverse groups and his remarkable leadership skills were instrumental in the successful resistance against the Axis powers. Beyond World War II, Tito's leadership and vision for Yugoslavia left a lasting impact on the country's history. While Yugoslavia eventually faced challenges that led to its dissolution, Tito's legacy endures. He is remembered as a unifying figure who fought for the rights of the working class, promoted self-management and socialism, and maintained an independent stance in international affairs. Thank you for joining us on this historical exploration, and don't forget to like this video, leave a comment sharing your thoughts. Until next time, keep discovering and learning.